loaded. How about that? Hello, welcome. You know what we do. We play a game for two hours. It is now eight o'clock, so we'll play until ten o'clock. Apparently, I learned this, the average gamer will, well, the average person, will spend two hours on a video game before deciding whether they're going to play any more, which is great, because that's how long I thought is a sensible amount of time, and that's how long I've been doing. So, we are being the average Joe. We're trying out video games that we've been given for free by Epic, and then we're deciding at the end of it whether those two hours have suitably impressed us to continue playing, whether they are reasonably good, but I don't have the time to continue playing, or whether they were dreadful. Last week we played Windbound, which I could see being a really chill game for someone to just hang out and play, but it was kind of tedious, so we didn't feel like it was something that you could... That you, you had to put so much time into basically doing nothing that you really like, needed to have the time on your hands, or you really needed to like that style of game to be able to play it. No shade if you do like that style of game, but we don't. This week, all well, I've, again, I'm going into this blind, I have no idea what this game is about. Um, so, I'm actually going to record this. I'm thinking of turning this into a, a YouTube series, if I can be bothered. <laughs> Basically, um, I need to find the time to condense this into like a 10-15 minute video that sort of explains what we come up with at the end of it, how we felt about it, but sort of as we play rather than at the end. So, let's, let's kick off. We have been accepted into Orwell. Please create a profile. Now I'm trying to, by the way, my phone stopped charging, so I'm in an old phone. And it's just, it's just not very good. <laughs> I'm trying to load simple things like Signal, and I can't log into Pocket Casts with Google, and it's just little things like that. It's like microaggressions. <coughs> Let's create a profile. I'll be this anonymous person. That seems very Orwellian. You have been selected for the Orwell test phase. Test phase. Uh, I will be called um, um, Stanley. That's that's invisible. We don't like that already. We don't like we don't like this contrast. Sites so profile picture. These people have got faces. These look generated, don't you think? Just based on the style. Maybe they're not. Maybe they're. Uh, This guy looks like a Stanley. Do you like this guy looking like a Stanley? Yeah. I mean, this guy is... He's a Ted. He's a Stan. Next step. Uh, no. Actually. Do I still have to check this? No. It says under. Never mind. I can't read. That's not going to be very good. Be diligent. Your work has severe impacts. Please agree to the following terms. I will adhere to the laws of judge. I will work thoroughly and judge objectively in the best of my belief. Now, welcome, Zucker. How are you doing? This is a slow start, but I am I'm digging it. It's not boring. It seems to be setting up the the gravitas. Of the situation. I did not give it my email address. Interesting. It seems laggy, but I think that's just the nature of the animations, to be honest with you. Searching. This anonymous person actually is. I found my work stuff is not concluding until right at the, like, the very last minute. Everyone's like, sod this. I'm uh, coming back tomorrow and finishing it off. One thing our work is good at is um, you stop working at half past five. You don't work through your lunch. You don't work before nine. You don't work past half past five. Just stop. Uh, and if there is any reason to do so, you will be either... Smacked on the wrist because it's not a good enough reason, or compensated probably in terms of finishing late, finishing early another day. Ah. Waiting on scripts. Let's press escape to script. Oh, there we go. It's a great way of uh, watching a stream is to wait for uh, scripts to run. I think we're fine. 
So we're watching this unfold, presumably through these cameras, because we're setting the scene, isn't it? Clocks were striking 13. Episode 1. You're online, good. Symes. I'm pressing it. I'm pressing it. So call me Symes, I will. I will be your advisor on Orwell. Together we will form both the first and the last line of defence against terrorism. Try this test phase. For this test phase, you are one of the first people to try out the Orwell system under real circumstances, select from thousands of applicants from across the globe. Lucky me. Normally, congratulations would be in order, but as you can see from that footage, there has been an incident, so let's get started. Semis. Sometimes you read them backwards to see if that's a thing. I'm assuming it's his surname. I've activated the reader tool for you. Aren't you nice? Its purpose is storing bookmarks to online websites and documents for easy access and to highlight when there is new information to be investigated. Okay. But I wanted to inform the situation. Our leading newspaper, The National Beholder, will bring you up to speed. We like that word. Headlines. It's dropping fra frames in a basically 2D game. <laughs> so silly. Bomb obliterate, obliterates Freedom Memorial and kills three. Feel free to browse the National Beholder. I've, uh, I've activated the under, open the unknown person file once you're done. It. All right, what have we got here? Negotiations in Triflith failed. Argusian like president aborts negotiation. Movie shooting completed. It seems like one of those games where you have to put a whole bunch of like, bits of information together and make decisions. I suspect this is going to be the majority of the game is looking at screens like this. Much like Papers, Please. Like, I'm not saying this is a bad way of presenting a game. It's going to be a more of a Papers, Please sort of... Like that, those police cop things where you're controlling where the police go on a map rather than going in all guns blazing, first person. Leaving nothing but rubble behind. Photo... Um. Props me, it's a bonton. These, these seem like... Um, Fake names. <laughs> this is extremely unbelievable because the only advert on all of this is Corrosion Technologies. I have not been told about cookies. I have not scrolled down two paragraphs and been said, hey, put your email address in. I've not been asked, hey, do you want to allow us to give you notifications? And there's no paywall, and there's no you know, continue reading even though you don't need a continue reading button. And everything loaded straight away. So I haven't had to keep scrolling as things at the top of the page fill in uh, because adverts are more important than content. Okay, so we've learned about Triplet and we've learned about 100 Grey Shadows. I'm not going to read that. Unknown person. Who are you? you? We don't know. The profiler holds all known information on those we investigate. This is our main suspect. Do you know what? Having unknown person as your main suspect is probably a really good way of going about it. Because if you don't know anything about them, you know that you have a main suspect. So put like a, a null character in there. Be like, hey, I, I don't know who you are. We're going to start somewhere. The blue haired woman that the CCTV footage shows before the assault is no stranger to the police. Take a look at the arrest record. Okay. Where? Oh. Here we go, bookmarks. Watergate Cassandra. The highlighted elements in the record are pieces of data that are able to be extracted. Ah! We've seen this sort of thing before in... Oh, it's papers, please, isn't it? Call these elements data chunks. However, in other data chunks, you've got the relevance of the case and any connections or information it may influence. Drag and drop all data chunks from the police database into a profile to upload them to our servers. Right. So, let's put your name in it, right? Is this you? Sandra Watergate. Might as well put the picture in. You can do that. Nice. So, how do you know uh, you got charged? Very good. Pictures and names are crucial information to identify a person. Information and documents. This is um, Half-Life 2. But just like the offices. Calling it, this is in the Half-Life 2 universe. There's Half-Life 2, there's Portal, like two 
competing facilities doing completely different things. And then there's just these guys in a uh, top floor, like in a <laughs> some penthouse in City 17, just doing this. Can only become a We can be clearly assigned to a target person. Okay. So if it's about just who knows. Add the reason for Miss Watergate's prior arrest that has just been unlocked. We will need this info to progress. Right, so that should go in one of these, I guess. Related documents. Fan! Previously arrested. Good. Thank you. I, I came up with it. With the data extracted from the police record, a new document can now be accessed. Do you believe in coincidence? Yes. It would be very coincidental if there wasn't any. Find data revealing why she attacked the police officer, and you will see what I mean. Just because some things are connected, doesn't mean some things are not. What did he say? Oh, yeah, document here. Is this woman a terrorist? Woman allegedly injured a police officer two weeks ago or remains in custody. The incident occurred during a rampage at the Freedom Plaza as part of a demonstration. Profile update. This cannot be undone seems important. I suppose it means that you can build up a, a profile on somebody but get it wrong. So that wasn't actually that person. And then because you've said, like you've drawn lines between facts that are not related to each other because there's no such thing as a coincidence. And therefore, things that seem related must be related, rather than, you know, coincidentally. Um, and therefore, you should put them on the thing. But you were wrong, because you didn't believe in coincidence, even though it was a coincidence. So now uh, an innocent person has been executed. But you know, Miss Watergate is still running around freely. We should find out why. But it says that she's still in custody. We should also gather more background information on that. I want to know who we're really dealing with. Okay, well, who we're really dealing with is um, Sharon Osborne. So, just deal with this. No, okay. click around, you find stuff. There's a star on this. What does that mean? Protest at the Freedom Plaza turned violent for me to Artist by profession. Thank you for showing me this. Do I have to pick this up, or is this gonna? Is this part of the tutorial, or is it just gonna keep doing that? Who does street? One who does street? Like blowing memorials to pieces. Do you know what? You have got to get your materials from somewhere. I don't. I don't. I have no problem with this. Great, we have found another document. Before we go on, let's clarify your job and how it affects mine, shall we? I'm not sure how I'm finding documents. Is it a tutorial thing? Am I going to have to... Um, do I unlock them? Are they... I don't know. If it's right, all the info I already knew about Miss Watergate starting now, I'm going into this case blind. The Orwell Ethical Codex dictates that investigators like yourself are the only ones allowed to access the documents of target persons. Advisors like me only get to see the data provided by the investigators. We will then draw conclusions and request action. Your primary job is to provide information you deem important. Never give away incorrect or misleading data. That's why it can't be undone. You may hit disable on a data chunk you do not want to pass on to Orwell. Some data chunks might be necessary to progress on the case. Right. What's our job now? Port.folio. Outstanding art. Which here's a picture. That actually looks happier. That's better. Is that, are they both here? Yeah. Cool. Um, what is this now? I'm not going to put your address as in Wonderland behind the rainbow. Although, let's take this. I might have to. We should find out what that job was. Nah. Tell account. <laughs> a chat handle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The listener has now been unlocked. Oh, here we go. New conversations will appear whenever they are started. Can I do this? No. I'm guessing it's just always going to be tracking. It's going to have a similar thing like this, right? It's just going to be there at things that have happened. Uh, let's continue with this. Free of charge. Career free. Career free. Mm. 
Please. Donate to my Patreon because I don't make any money out of this because I give everything away. Product placements in my fine art. My beloved furball Kikiko. Less than three, definitely the only family I need. Yes, well, it's the only family you're going to get. I was never sure about the title, though. Is that a self-portrait? That view is me, yeah? That seems... I, I think I can draw that conclusion, so I will add that. It looks like what's happening is the things. some of the things you hover on are conclusions that you could draw from what it says, but are not actually the correct conclusion to draw from what it says. So if you put it in there, you're going to have false information. Christmas present for my darling. In a relationship. But... But your cats. Your cats are the only family you'll ever need. Uh, I hope that he likes you. <laughs> because that's a Christmas present. Confused by your everything. Okay, let's uh, let's go on here. Headlines. These stars seem to mean look here for more stuff. I haven't read this yet. Official poster. It's not. We don't recognise these people, do we? No. Completion of any scene featuring both actors was nothing short of pulling teeth. As actors, I think that was just simply telling me that. Um, we'd not read it yet. Oh, look, something's happening here. And then first, hey, you. That's her husband. Hmm. Hmm. She don't know. We do anything with this while it's waiting. A minute ago, I like this. It's updated. Yeah. Stole a credit card from. I'm not going to put that. It's a. It's obviously a joke. Like she she took it. I wouldn't say she stole it. Yo, that's obviously your partner. Bring wine for dinner. Rep up a related person. Nice. Data chunks will only appear for targeted persons and can only be extracted into their relevant profiles. Yes, fine. So let's go on this then. Hang on, is she having an affair or is this her husband? Go back. Go back. How do I go back? Can I go back? Ah. I guess we have to do it that way. Armour entrepreneurs. Yeah, Watergate. What? Will you know what you got was wrong or because if you will know what you got wrong. Oh, I see what you mean, yeah. Is it going to tell you at the end? Like on Papers, Please. It gives you a, it's a feedback, I think, right? Then at the end of the session. Right, let's see if we can search this dude up then. I'm not going to put that. It doesn't seem relevant. Products. I wish the web were this simple. Couch and dessert and chat. Come on. You know you want to know how it goes. Well, you can watch the VOD. Have fun. Enjoy your couch. And couch sounds good. Can I put things on here? It doesn't seem to change what we do based on who's selected, so I think that's probably okay. Company. Bruno wants to go. Father? Mother. Juno Koo. I suppose we're not creating necessarily um, 
profiles on her parents because it's just her parents. It's possible she's in cahoots with them for all of this, but it seems more likely than it's somebody else. Or like a lawyer. She did mention that. We'll soon be joining. We'll soon be joining music. Okay, we have to actually prove it's them. We can't just guess. That makes sense. It's a family affair. Well, what's happening? Documents that you have already reviewed may be updated from time to time as events unfold. The reader will notify you when that happens. New article. All right. We're doing clicks. So this is the Beholder. This is. So these are websites that were sort of. I really like this aggregator. Can we have this IRL? Please. Procedure closing raises manipulation suspicions. Investigation into the malicious injury of a police officer has been dropped due to lack of evidence. Speculated that the accused parents manipulated the trial. Triumphant, this is all well informed me some conflicted data chunks. Okay. Whenever the content of two data chunks are at odds with one another, those will be shown as conflicted. In track one, the containing computers will become invalid immediately. I recommend that you clarify the context of the conflict before you proceed, though this is your decision. Once the information has been passed, there is no way to reverse your choice. Right, so we've got... This will replace... Criminal case closed due to lack of evidence. Versus what? That is in... Previously arrested. That doesn't conflict with anything. Show conflict. So these conflict with each other inside the same document, I guess. That was a lack of evidence, but this says the wealthy family of the accused might have influenced the outcome in her favour. So we have to decide whether we believe that it was closed due to lack of evidence, or whether we believe that there was some sort of fiddling going on. There is conflict with another data stream. Let's talk about conflict. That one. Case might be reopened should new evidence be discovered. Joseph Langley. Hey, look. Put the pick. Do the. Come on. And then it says, the defence brought video evidence, brought video evidence depicting the incident in question, which eventually turned the tide of the proceeding. Meanwhile, the relatives of the victim expressed their disappointment on hearing the result of the lawsuit. Openly a voice concerns that the wealthy family might have accused. So, do we believe that it was closed due to lack of evidence because the lawyer was like, there's no evidence? Or do we believe that it was closed because someone influenced something, like, sort of got it shut down on a hush hush? Now, this could be the cover up for that. So, which one do we pick? The parents may have closed the target person's criminal case by illegal means. I'm going to put. So that says may have. Whereas this is a fact, right? So we'll keep may have wrong, wrong, wrong profile. Thank you for noticing that it was the wrong profile. Parents may have closed the target. This is a severe accusation. Since we already know who her parents are, we will immediately begin investigating these allegations. Because we're smart, you see, we've done our, we've done our work. All right, that was tuned. Crime rate continues to drop. Boring. Never before have there been so few violent crimes. So we do one big one to make up for it. That's how it works, man. Come on. Don't you know nothing? I wonder if my uh, I wonder if signal is working on my phone. Yes. Yeah, uh, might reset it. Delacroix gave a press conference earlier this morning. Uh, a link. Safety bits passed. The party is elected. The party! Such a 
safety of the system. Sped up process of taking investigative measures against criminal suspects and their prosecution. The Parge's peacekeeping mission. The terrorist incident of 2008 was a terrible consequence of the premature retreat of our troops from Parge, a region torn by civil unrest for years by the order of the previous government to fix up the party. Immediately made preparations to send our highly reliable soldiers back to save them. Sounds like America. We haven't got enough safety over here. We'll send some troops in. Okay, projects. What's this now? No, it's the website that we're on. Wait, what? Right. Please go back. Oh, that was just some random ass website. That was the party website. I see, I see. So that's where we were on this. This is tabs. These are tabs. Hang on. It thinks there's still information in here. Positions? Just browse the government website on stream. This is a great game, just browsing websites. Safety and security. I like this game, even though it's browsing websites, because they've put so much effort into making these websites browsable. Why can't the people who made this game make actual websites? This is so much better than everything I have ever seen on the internet. There is actual information on the front page of this website. That is insane. Do you not know how the internet works? We believe in strict safety regulations to preserve the life and well-being of every individual. Strict safety regulations. This is why we strive for constant healthy growth, our cultural origins, as well as the significance of family and community. Right? Can't click on it. It's not going to give me any more information. But it, all of that was English. There was no buzzwords. Can you not just please write the internet? Oh, I want these people. I don't. I don't want them to be making this game. I want them to make my website. Prime Minister Blaine, Catherine Delacroix, Peter Faulkner. Is that the one we saw before? Yeah. Those projects we got. Participate. Donate. Volunteer. Become a member. Join the army of the nation. Well, now it's gone away, so there's more to click on. Uh, right. Company. So we, we went through here. We can't take these pictures yet. Even though they're, you know. Right. But we could, we could add them to their profiles. Jobs at Watergate Farmer Dot Tana Nothing bad. Uh, currently looking for a chief retired formerly appointed predecessor. So we've learned that she is retired. Ouch. You're thinking that Miss Watergate underwent quite a radical change, don't you agree? What may have caused this radical shift? wasn't you? Just on, just timeline. You're invited to tea inside. Oh, we've gone to her. You, you tell. I have got a date of birth. Let's put that in. Activism. What a lineup. That is just a standard hippie. What are you talking about? The target. Sandra Watergate Pattern, 1017. Far away from the shackles of Watergate Palmer. Father? 12 likes, 2 comments. What? Who's going to pay for stuff now? Not dead. My oh, already got me a lot of money. More than enough to pay all my bills. Don't you worry about me. Despised puppets of the state. You have finally managed to destroy us entirely. There is nothing left to do but congratulate you. These are my personal wishes to you from the deepest abyss of my heart. Fuck all you government lackeys! Most painfully, Cassandra. Those is the government then. Speak to you, what's the matter? I ain't ages. <laughs> Am I a lackey? You gotta get out of time to time. You know what? I'm really sorry I still care about my best friend, no matter how she decides to move to cold shop. Broken friendship. Upload is strongly discouraged. Oh, 
We haven't, we haven't found the, the conflict yet. How do you know there's a conflict if I have, if you don't know what it is? Cassandra Watergate changed the status. Joseph Lang. There you go, you see. Not a member of Parliament. Told you. I mean, we expected it. But fair play to them. That conversation did not actually say that they were in a relationship. It heavily implied that they were, but it didn't say that it was the same person. We could, we weren't sure if it was an affair or not. So 